All right, we've got attempt number two on this old girl. Uh, I don't know about this battery. Well, holy shit. All the gauges are gauging. Excellent. It's not even smoking the neighbors out. Welcome back to the garage. Uh, so today I did a little bit of shopping. I, uh, let me show you what I got. So I popped over to the Napa and I picked up a battery here. The world's cheapest battery. Or it was the cheapest battery they sold. And an oil pan gasket. The most expensive oil pan gasket they sell. Ah, my priorities are fucked, right? This is for the Comanche. We're finally doing the Comanche. I know a few of you guys have been waiting for it. I've been waiting for it. Last fall, I kind of tried to do this, but then it snowed and I gave up. So here we are. Springtime, 2018. We're going to get the old Comanche going. So I got her a battery because it was clear to me the old one was toast. And when I pulled it out, it was bulging on the sides and that battery was no good. I had it sitting on this charger out there for ages. Uh, if you saw my one video where I tried to get it going. Why did I get the expensive gasket? I did this oil pan gasket on this truck about th three or four years ago. And I used the cheapo $20 four-piece, you know, cork sides rubber ends type of gasket and now maybe I put it in wrong I don't think so but it's you know anything's possible so when we get around to pulling it out and putting this one in we can do a little autopsy and see what it did wrong so this guy wasn't bad it was about 50 bucks it's a Felpro one whole piece we'll see what bumps in the road we run into along the way so for now I'm gonna let this guy uh, I mean who knows how long it's been sitting on the shelf at the store right get her all freshened up so when she strains to start that old beast it won't kill her she is back in the garage for the first time in man a couple of years I think and uh, it sure looks short compared to the XJ now I'm pretty used to that being lifted up she's a little faded has a bit of a funky smell I don't know if something died inside it or what the new battery got her going she runs like a top I don't know how this thing runs so good after sitting so long that gas in it's probably almost jello I guess I'm gonna Start poking around and see if I can figure out where this oil drip's coming from. I suspect it's my oil pan gasket, but I want to make sure. And my differential, the only differential I have on this one, it's two-wheel drive. So that diff back there at the rear, it's leaking. Yeah. Cool stuff. Well, I think that'll do it for this video. Hit that like button and leave a comment down below if there's some Comanche stuff you'd like to see. In upcoming videos, I'm going to make you watch while I fix my leaky diff and figure out where all that oil is coming from. Make sure you're subscribed and hit that dumb little bell icon if you want to be the first to see my new videos. Thanks for watching and happy ranching!